Tarzan of the Apes, from the novels by Edgar Rice Burroughs, with Mr. James H. Pierce as Tarzan, and Miss Joanne Burroughs as Jane Porter. This is an American Gold Seal production. While seeking his daughter Jane, who has been carried off by an ape, Professor Porter and his party are captured by cannibals and trapped in the sacred temple cave by the witch doctor. Jane has been rescued from the ape by Tarzan, who takes her to the cannibal village to look for her father. Inside the cave, the whites discover that the witch doctor, supposedly in a trance, has disappeared. Now, are you ready? Hold your breath! You're positive, Donna, that you left the witch doctor here in this spot? Of course, Monsieur Clayton. Absolutely, Clayton. We left the black here with Francois de Garden. And now they're both gone. And if they're not in the cave... Exactly, Monsieur. There is another way out. True. It's evident that Francois must have liberated the witch doctor. Francois would sacrifice his life, Monsieur, before he would turn traitor. But the witch doctor was tied and Francois was guarding. That explains nothing. But we now know definitely that there is another way out, and we must find it. Yes, of course. The sulfur fumes are... they are becoming more noticeable. Better get back on the higher level. The monsieur has right. Let us go. I feel sure that the exit must be from that gallery, since Monsieur Clayton pointed out the air is purer above. Uh, on that opposite side of the cave, it is much cooler. That might indicate water. And you infer from that, Professor? Uh, since there is no water actually coming into the cave, that water might be outside. And therefore, the thickness of the rock at that point cannot be excessive. Hey, wait. Everything points to the exit being on that side? Come. We begin our search. More More It is... Francois? This is here that I am. Can you hear me? Yes, but we cannot tell where you are. If we come from behind the altar. Uh, no, from the other end of the tavern. As for myself, I cannot tell. Francois, continue speaking. Tell me what happened. As soon as you have gone, the witch doctor came out of his trance. By gesture, he indicated that he would lead me outside. I went, thinking I could come back and lead you out. Now, I cannot find my way back in. Which way did you get out? By the stairway. Behind the altar, close to where you left me, go up about 15 steps. You come to a corridor. Yes, yes, we know where that is, but then to the left or to the right? To the left hand, after that, at the extreme end of... What? What is it, Francois? The, the witch doctor. We would have learned the secret. I think. I think I found torches stuck in the wall. Are you sure? Here. You are right. Quickly, then. Light one. Uh, we may be in time, Francois. Francois, we are coming! Out. 
outside the cave in the treetops, Jane and Tarzan watched the natives as they examined the body of the black Tarzan has killed and thrown down at them. I, I wonder what they'll do now, Tarzan. Look for Tarzan and Jane. You think we are safe here? Perhaps we'd better go over toward the hill, back of the cave. I wait for Chief. Then I... Then, then what, Tarzan? I kill. Get out. Now, Devil Man makes this noise to call Goman Gang. Almost looks as if you were right, Tarzan. They, they're all looking toward the cave. All right, if Tarzan go to top of hill, try to see if Father and the rest are where Tarzan can talk to them. And leave me here alone? Yes. Oh, no, you're not. I'm going with you. I don't want to be left alone. And if there is a chance to talk to Father, I... Right. Look, Gome and Danny all going away. Yes, and that weird noise. It's either dying out or it's going farther away. After Gome and Danny all gone, we go to cave. But tell them, I don't like to wait with Daddy in there. Perhaps hurt, perhaps needing me. If we go now, we must fight Gome and Danny. Then they stay. We want them to go, not stay. Yes, yes, you're right, Tarzan. You generally are. Jane loves Tarzan? What? You would remember that word. Don't you know, Tarzan, that sitting on the limb of a tree a hundred feet above the ground is no place to ask questions like that? No, I don't know. Well, then, you'll just have to take it from me that it is. But, Jane, I want to know. I see you do. Now, Tarzan, be a dear and don't ask that now. As Daddy would say... Don't be so precipitous. It's a delicate question. It requires tact. Tact? What is tact? Sometimes it's thinking one thing and saying another. And always it means not saying what you'd like to say in the way you'd like to say it. Tact no good. Tarzan, love Jane. You mustn't. But Tarzan do. But Tarzan mustn't say it. That Tarzan is tact. Jane like tact? Yes. Oh, 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 well, a little tact. But that is tact. I do not say I love Jane. I just love her. You're the most embarrassing person I ever met. Embar- er, er, embarrassing? Yes, Tarzan. That's another word you don't know. But as I said, a hundred feet above the ground in the top of a tree is not the place to ask a girl if she loves you. And it's equally unsuited to lessons in English. Oh, look, Tarzan. What? Lights. More natives. Away on top of the hill. No. Not lights from Goldman, Ganny. Lights from Father and others. Then, don't you think we should go there now without waiting? Yes, Jane. Hold on to Tarzan. Tarzan, go quickly. Oh, I wonder what my friends at home would think if they saw me being carried through the treetops like this. Like this? This is the only way to carry Jane. Yes. Tarzan... You had the unhappy knack of seizing upon the wrong part of a sentence to emphasize. I was not referring to the manner in which you carry me, but merely to the fact that I'm being carried through the treetops. I see. I hope you do. I, I'm i not uncomfortable. In fact, I rather like being carried this way. But you don't have to be constantly referring to it. I think uh, we can go down now. You, I'll never get used to that, Tarzan. You dropped down like a streak of lightning. Did you ever lose your hold? No. Come now. Take Tarzan's hand. The ground is rough. Big stone. Yes, boulders, Tarzan. 
I think. I'm sure it was over there that I saw the light. Yes. This way we have to climb. Now, uh, I'll lift you up, Jane. Uh, a crack in the rock star, then. Do you suppose it leads into the cave? Can't tell. Look, Jane. More light. Yes. They're away down below us, Tarzan. Can I take a chance on calling out? Wait. Maybe we see who it is first. The opening is such a small one, nobody could get through. But I now I can see. I can see Daddy. Daddy, Daddy. Mr. Fernando. Tato. Tato. Daddy. Mr. Fernando. Uh, uh, what is it? Uh, 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 am I hearing things? Fernando. Mr. Fernando. Tato. It's Jane. 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 Is the cleft in the rocks wide enough to get through? No, we can't even get our heads inside. We can barely hear you. How far up are you? How far down did Daddy call them? Oh, a big tree down. Call them about the height of a big tree. That is probably more than 100 feet. One and a half feet. Professor and the others out of the cave? Or will the witch doctor, who has made good his 